So maybe you love shooting home movies of your kids beating 12 shades out of one another, but your current smartphone turns out with blurry, fugly results. Or maybe you just fancy yourself as the next Chris Nolan and you want a smartphone that can shoot really crisp, gorgeous looking 4K HDR footage on demand. Whatever your personal needs, we've reviewed dozens of smartphone snappers over the past year alone. And here are our favorite camera phones for recording video, picked out for their video recording skills and features. And we've even included a couple of budget friendly options in case your skin is f***. And don't forget to poke subscribe and ding that notifications bell for more on the latest and greatest mobile tech. Cheers everyone! So first up, pretty much every smartphone over the £250 to £300 price point now comes with the option to shoot 4K video. That means crisp, highly detailed footage when viewed back on an Ultra HD telly or monitor. Many mobiles also offer the option of shooting at 60 frames per second rather than that traditional 30 FPS. This higher frame rate produces super smooth, hyper-realistic results whenever you're capturing a subject in motion. However, even now in 2019, relatively few smartphones actually combine the 4K resolution and 60 frames per second. One of the first to do so was Apple's iPhone and the iPhone XS maintains that feature. Clips shot at this level look impressively natural, while Apple's image stabilization holds up admirably. You still don't get much shake when walking and shooting. On the Android front, Samsung's Galaxy Note 9 also captures great looking footage at that 4K 60fps level. But if your budget is a bit tighter, then the OnePlus 6T can also shoot 4K video at 60fps. And again, the image stabilization is surprisingly strong. And likewise, Xiaomi's Mi Mix 3 also offers this feature. One always dependable manufacturer when it comes to smartphone cameras is Sony Mobile. You're always guaranteed strong video results with its flagship smartphones and the Xperia XZ3 is no different. This is one of the only smartphones around that can shoot 4K video with full HDR support. This high dynamic range feature means impressive detail levels when shooting a high contrast scene. Those bright areas don't drown out the rest of the image, so you still get fine detail in those darker sections. We well, use it only when necessary as this mode does occasionally mess with more vivid colours, but it definitely makes a real difference when you really need it. The Xperia XZ2 Premium also boasts 4K HDR recording and proves very dependable for low light shooting too, thanks to its formidable combination of RGB and monochrome lenses. Even at night you get very little grain and some sharp contrast. So this would definitely be a great choice for shooting nighttime events like fireworks and stuff like gigs. But whatever you do, please don't shoot gigs on a smartphone. I mean I'm a short ass, so whenever I go to a gig all I can see is a sea of goddamn smartphone screens. Now we're starting to see a few premium smartphones emerge with multiple camera lenses and we're not just talking about dual lens shooters with a basic depth sensor here. Huawei's Mate 20 Pro for instance boasts a wide angle and a telephoto option on top of that primary lens and you can switch between the three for shooting video at up to 4K resolution to get a very different view. This level of flexibility is seriously impressive for a mobile device, although be warned. While the Mate 20 Pro shoots smooth looking 4K video, we have experienced some image tearing at the far left and right edges, thanks to the image stabilization feature. Another option with this level of flexibility is the LG V40, and we really can't fault the video results here at all. Not only do you have those three lenses to choose from, but the results look stunning across a full range of conditions. You can actually go check out my full Mate 20 Pro vs LG V40 camera comparison to see how they stack up. And if you simply want a no fuss camera phone that can shoot great looking video, you also can't go wrong with Google's latest Pixel 3 and Pixel 3 XL. 4K resolution video shot at 30fps looks perfectly natural, while that solitary lens adapts to any sudden changes in focal distance or ambient lighting pretty much instantaneously. And stabilization is nice and smooth too when you're moving and shooting at the same time. Some smartphones also now offer a super slow motion feature, shooting at a heady 960 frames per second for seriously impressive results when played back. Sony is the best around right now, shooting these clips at full HD resolution, something that I've only seen matched by Xiaomi's Mi Mix 3. The rest will do it at 720p and to be honest it looks a bit grainy and crap. Now if your budget is a bit tight and you don't have £500 plus to spend on a new smartphone just for recording a bit of video then no worries. For instance the Nokia 7 Plus costs around the sort of £300-£350 mark and still gets off thumbs up when it comes to its video recording skills. This Zeiss branded camera can capture 4K resolution footage with typically crisp and colourful results. The focus deals well with whatever you throw at it, although image stabilization is a bit janky at that Ultra HD level, so you'll want to not move around too much while shooting. One video feature we love on Nokia's handsets is the Ozo Audio Capture. This does an impressive job of producing 360 degree surround sound when viewing back your videos with headphones. And for a little less cash we also recommend Motorola's Moto G Plus handsets. The Moto G6 Plus back from 2018 is still a star, again offering 4K resolution video with admirable results. 
Slot right there is our roundup of the best camera phones in early 2019 for recording video. Did I miss out your own personal favourite? Well, definitely let us know in the comments down below. And don't forget to poke subscribe and ding that notifications bell for more on the latest and greatest tech. Cheers, everyone. Love you.